has your views changed with uh, the strangeness in 2020 and the continued strangeness strangeness of 2021? Or do you think this is just part of the cycle? Well, uh, the way I understand the cycle is that it is uh, peaking currently uh, between 2000, the year 2000, uh, when on May 5th, there was an alignment of the seven planets of antiquity until uh, December 21st, 2021, or sorry, 2012 now, uh, the past, no longer the future. Uh, when uh, the sun and earth and galactic core all aligned as predicted by the Mayans, uh, then that was the peak 11-year uh, period in the uh, sunspot cycle for the Aeon. Uh, so uh, we saw the maximum amount of solar activity then, which caused the maximum amount of uh, essentially heat in the global atmosphere and everybody uh, could identify that as either global warming or as uh, climate change, either one uh, because it was exacerbated by human pollution, but it wasn't entirely caused by it. So uh, at this point in that cycle, we're at a peak for space weather activity. Uh, and also I believe at a period of convergence between these timelines uh, in con uh, comparison to Aleister Crowley's uh, concept of the equinox of the gods, I think that uh, when uh, one aeon calendrically rolls over into the next, uh, it corresponds to all of these uh, astronomical or astrological type events. Uh, and uh, what you see on the earth during that period of time is usually a period of great social upheaval and uh, a lot of philosophies forming, a lot of so-called false prophets and a lot of uh, so-called magicians, self-proclaiming magicians running around that, you know, 600, 400 years ago, you wouldn't have seen that many and that that's uh, the cause. But I do believe that after the year 2029, uh, these timelines will begin to diverge again and the peak uh, sunspot cycle phase will be diminishing and that what we've called global warming will begin to wane and descend into a cooling phase. 